Remember to sign out of Facebook when you leave your computer. Or someone can change your favorite band to Nickelback. We welcome the star of that PSA and quarterback of the 10th ranked Arkansas Razorbacks, Tyler Wilson. How you doing, Tyler? I'm good. Thanks for having me on. Cool. I gotta ask you, what's up with wearing the jerseys around campus? Give civilians a chance. You need to remind people at all times that you are the star of the football team. <laughs> That's only at ESPN when we wear the jerseys on campus. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Hey, you got you to gotta rock those jerseys. Wear them with pride around oh, campus. All right, moving, moving on to a little football question. Everybody's talking about Paul Petrino taking over the play call and responsibilities there from Bobby. Uh, he's been there for a while, so he's familiar with the system, but have you noticed any differences? Will, will we see any type of a different look from your offense this year? Well, I think, I think uh, you know, the difference is, is they're, they're different people. They've got different things that they like offensively. Uh, you know, but, but, but on my behalf, I mean, it's really the same offense verbalization and, and everything, so, so it's not, a been, not been a big change up for me, so I'm not sure sure how many how much difference it'll be for the viewer on the field but, but there'll be some slight differences well they are different people paul and bobby petrino but i wanted to ask you who has more game off the field <laughs> that's just not right <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to answer that that's one tyler a, i'm gonna go ahead and give it to him. Oh, paul you, know, oh, yeah. you want to step up for paul <laughs> i'm sticking up for tyler he's trying to play it right paul you know? plays within the confines <laughs> of society yeah. Well, Tyler, you guys lost some receivers last year, although I do think you have a 235-pound 6'4 advantage in Brandon Mitchell. Who do you see as some of the emerging breakout talent for 2012? Well, I think we've got a number of guys that you might not have not have heard of that, that wide receiver that I think you, you, uh, you'll see make a little bit of an impact. Um, you know, obviously, the, the, there's the key guys. There's Niall Davis, um, Kobe Hamilton. Uh, the, the playmakers that everybody will talk about. But, but you'll see some, like, you know, like you mentioned, Brandon Mitchell, uh, Javante Herndon. And we've got we've got some core guys up front on the offensive line that'll, that'll make an impact. Um, you know, but those guys don't get talked about. And that's Travis Swanson and Alvin Bailey, and and uh, it'll be a big reason why we will we'll, we'll run the ball inside and, and uh, between the tackles this year. Tyler, now last year I broke down a lot of your game film, and I was always pointing out how tough you were because you hung in the t you hung tough in the pocket, put your back foot in the ground looked right in the pass rush, but man, I saw you taking way too many hits. What are you going to do for your offensive lineman here? How can you get them to block a little bit better? Maybe take them to dinner at night? How can you inspire them up front to do a little bit better job for you? Well, we, we, I've got a couple things planned. i got, I got to propose it to them first, figure out what they like. But, uh, you know, they, they'll, they'll continue to do a great job. You know, I'll, I'll, never, I'll never say that. You know, some, sometimes I'm not getting this in the right protection, so it's not always on them. Um, you know, I, I think you know they're, they're a good group of guys, and, and they're, they're much more versed this year. A lot of those guys got a lot, of, tremendous amount of playing time last year, so they're, they're going to be better. And uh, you know, we'll see if we can't take them out to dinner or, or have them over to the house and, and, uh, and grill out a couple nights a week. Tyler, you're a very nice guy. You're very soft-spoken. <laughs> you're very considerate. I want you to be bold right now. How many games are the Arkansas Razorbacks going to win this season? <laughs> Claim it. Hey, you know, you know, hey, there's there's no reason why we shouldn't win every, every single one of them. There you, you know, go. We do the things we, we do the things we can do, um, play the way we can play. Uh, that's our goal. That's what we set every year, and, and uh, there's no reason why we could. I like him. I like him too. <laughs> Tyler Wilson, that's Fire. Arkansas starting quarterback right there. If he succeeds at the NFL after that, we might see him as a politician. My man knows how to handle an interview. Thanks for hanging with us, Tyler. <laughs> 